Well, that's different. What is all this? If I had a guess, I'd say it's some kind of lock mechanism to open that door. Okay, on the left, we have Shiva gifting Parashurama the axe. And on the right, we have Parashurama chopping off Ganesha's tusk. Wait, with the axe? Yeah. The one that Shiva, Ganesha's father, gave to Parashurama? Yeah. <laughs> it's messed up. That's family. Come on, let's see about opening that door. So how does all this work? Oh, only one way to find out. Let's see what this does. All right, that slid the piece away from me. Salah and the tiger. Here we go. Fingers crossed. That's supposed to happen? 
I know. Just don't get us killed. You're no fun. Ready? Oh. Careful. Hmm. Amazing. What the shiva? Mm, my thoughts exactly. Oh no, no, it's okay. I think we're gonna be okay. Okay? Where the hell's the tusk? I don't know, none of this makes any sense. Yeah, it does. The Hoysala sent us on a fool's errand. I think you're right. Terrific. No. Hear me out. Ganesh is the symbol of... Halabadu. And Shiva was the symbol of... Belor. Which was the old... The old capital. Exactly. What if the king built this spectacular city, and it was a wonderful target for the Persians? And the old capital was forgotten. So this whole city was a decoy. What if they let it get plundered to protect Belor? And their treasure. I'm willing to bet the tusk was never here at all. So where's Belong? Oh shit. This is definitely not supposed to happen. It's coming loose! Oh. Grab the edge, quick! Was that? <laughs> I'm really embarrassed for you right now. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't there a huge waterfall here? There was. What the hell is that? Aqueduct. <laughs> Water's channeling there from the falls. Amazing. Did we do this just now? Well, technically I did. Cocky. <laughs> Look, uh, sorry if I cut too close to the bone back there. You know, you two would have got on like a house on fire. He was also a really stubborn dickhead. <laughs> you know, none of
none of this could have possibly gone unnoticed. We should probably get out of here. Good point. Follow me. All right. Oh. The water is being channeled toward the gate. So let's follow the aqueduct. Copy that. I'll take point. They flooded their city to protect their secrets. You think the soldiers knew they were being used as decoys? Honesty is not always the best policy. That's true. You need your people behind you 100%. So you think Asav's keeping his men in the dark? Didn't give it up. Right. You take left, I take right.
yet. Where are we? No idea. But at least we're not in the line of fire. That thing carved on the floor. What do you suppose it is? Those channels? I doubt they were meant for water. Oh. Up here. Think there's a way through. <coughs> Poor bastards. I don't know. I'd prefer being left to rot in the cell to getting tortured. Duly noted. Now, how the hell do we get out? Look up. Ha! Ha! Right you are. Hear that? I do. Yep. There's the aqueduct. Up here, there's a breach. Shiva. It's impressive. My man worked for a week and turned up nothing. They probably hired the wrong expert. Perhaps. You know. A Hoysala poet once wrote of a young king who showed mercy and thus ended our rituals. But the old kings, they understood that progress demands sacrifice. <laughs> Is that what you tell your men? of war, these aqueducts, they would run red through the capital. Those who would not fight had to be used to inspire those who would. Leave her alone, asshole! Let's make this quick. Give me back my disc. Come get it. You need to work on your reflexes. So slow. Shit! Proud of yourself? A little, yeah. Come on. Swing in a minute. You see, to rule a people, you must first sow chaos. Wait. I will incite my civil war, stamp out the weak bloodline of the young king, starting with you. Get him! Yeah. 
Take it easy. You've been out for almost half an hour. Half an hour? Yeah. Oh, shit. <sighs> shit, the Sarv's got the disc. Just hang on. Oh, we gotta get going. Hey, uh, relax, all right? Think you can manage? Yeah, I've had worse nights, believe me. <laughs> I won't ask. <laughs> it's good to have you back. There's... There's two of you now, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's go and get our disc. And some guns. And some guns. <sighs> uh, can I just say, you were not joking about Asad. I mean, wow, he looks so unassuming. Right? That's exactly what he wants. Pretty sure his glasses are an affectation. To make him look harmless or smart? Both. <laughs> but he is smart. Was a doctor before he took up his course. So he left behind a lucrative career. I'm sure at one point he thought it was the right thing to do. Hey. You sure you're good to go? As good as I'll ever be. Just need to take it easy for a bit. Up here. Go slow. Good. We made it. Let's get that thing open. Shiva's gatekeeper. That's got to be the entrance to the old capital. It had to be triggered by the aqueducts. Yep. Oh, shit. Asov's already heading inside. Okay, well, we better get down there. Come on. No. What do you mean, no? Sam Drake. He's a goddamn expert. He's Sam Drake. Yeah. Peace. You know what? This is a good thing. I can kill two birds with one stone. Nadine. What? What? Sam's kind of the reason why we're here in the first place. Oh, you better be joking. This was my deal. <gasps> Sam went ahead to do recon oh, for me on the disc, but then he went missing and I couldn't leave You knew him my for history dead. with Sam and then you dragged me into this anyway? Your history with the Sav made you the obvious... <laughs> Don't hold back or anything. Oh, I did. You know what, Nadine? It doesn't change anything. You'll still get your share. Yeah? Or maybe you and Sam will cut me out as soon as you get the task. Come on, man. That's not how I operate. That's exactly how your type operates. <sighs> and to think I trusted you. Listen. I was going to tell you about Sam. I swear I was just waiting for the right time to... It's fine. I, I could use the exercise. Shit. 